All right, that's a zoo bat. I know a zoo bat when I see one. That is a Pokemon. <laughs> owl house, ooh, I get in the owl house, and the ooh, I ate in the get in house, and the owl house, and a who, who, who. Ooh. Anyways, we're going to go to Owl House. So let's get straight into it. Before we get started on the vibes, hit that like button, hit subscribe button, leave a comment down below to feed the algorithm. Go out, check us out on Patreon for early access to reactions, unfiltered, uncensored, uncut. Let's get it. Aura, Hecate began. Our paths have crossed only in battle. <gasps> An ally. Azora is able to befriend everyone, even her biggest rival. I wish I... Witch in the boiling aisles has its purpose. All right, what is it? A baby? No, King. Till morning, ye ye. No, ye ye. These are awful. Not happening. <laughs> <laughs> Money. Get in with her and you're set for life. So, we keep this thing alive for a few hours. The fact they put a child on your doorstep of the, one of the most powerful witches in the aisles is that this baby's a fucking handful. <laughs> All right. She gave the baby to you to look after? That baby's a fucking problem. Just saying. I don't want her getting a cut of the meat. Good thinking. <laughs> <laughs> Scheming. All right, that's a zoo bat. I know a zoo bat when I see one. That is a Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> She's always in a lot of the scenes, huh? Oh. Grass and blood stains. These are Edas, aren't they? <laughs> that was a crazy night. Okay, that is fair of him to say. In a library. It's not his job to be your version of Google. Read, bitch, read. That's fair. He'll read a book. We have dial up. Oh, wait, we're your friends, and we want to help, said the tin boy with a yelp. Mm -mm. Hold up, I need to stop eating so much. I'm sorry, I'm I have this thing where I told stories before I started recording this, and while I was telling stories, I was just drinking the whole time instead of eating. <laughs> And now that I slowed down on drinking, now I'm eating a lot because I've been drinking. <laughs> so I'm real snacky. <laughs> All right. So it's like, <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> it's one or the other, man. I don't know. Just think of it like this. Just think of you're watching this with a homie. She's, I'm just shooting the breeze with you and we're just eating some food, okay? Don't get all weird about it. I hate it when she eats when... No, 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 no. Think of it as a vibe. It's a vibe check. How about you grab some snacks and you join me? All right? There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Forget about it, huh? Also, it's adorable that she's reading to kids. I like that Amity's doing that. Yeah. Be your first. The chicken witch clucked. Odebin couldn't believe his luck. Oh. 
Cheers! Maybe I can befriend her like Azora befriended her. Oh, that's a little too far up. Loose, that's a little too far. What the fuck, Braxis? <laughs> Boys. Human, do you see me going to the owl shack and bugging you while you fry up owl? Oh, I'm chewing. Oh, I'm. <laughs> it's coming. All right. She's saying she's doing it for extra credit, but she secretly enjoys it. The reason being is that if you're putting that much effort to do little voices, little changes, and make sure the kids are happy, and she's also smiling at the kids at the end too, and even when they were walking away, she genuinely enjoys it. She's just talking at her ass because she wants to. Like it could also be extra credit too, but at the same time, she does enjoy it. She's a, she's deep down, she's a good kid. That is also fair. Because Luz is kind of a disaster girl energy. And if your whole goal is to, like, rise up in the industry, and you got a disaster girl who constantly gets you in trouble, and you want your Sigma grind set? No, nah, I get it, man. It's like you're literally distracting me and deterring me from my goals and ambitions. You need to back the fuck up, bitch. Friendships are temporary at this age. <laughs> oh, a part of her feels bad for saying that. Oh, shit. Yeah. Amity! Befriending rivals. You're gonna let her get to you like that? Alright, who are these two? Oh! Older siblings! Oh! Yeah, makes sense. She seems too cool for you. I am? You can leave now, all of you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the siblings just cooked the fuck out of her. That's crazy. <laughs> How you embarrassed her at the school and at the witch convention last week. No wonder she hates you. I all right, you know what? I'm getting a vibe from this. Hold on, let me cook. I'm getting the kind of vibe where it's like they're going to do something towards Amity and Luz is going to help Amity out during that and it's going to build more of a nicer connection between Amity and Luz. That's what I feel like is happening. Oh. Here we go towards our non-fiction section. <gasps> okay, they're the pranky kinds, okay. <laughs> huh? Oh my god, he is falling apart. Maybe we shouldn't swap him. Maybe he's not the- Maybe Let's fuck with somebody else instead. All right, there we go. Thank you, Gary. I need your breakdown again. Thanks, buddy. For me, I'm like a little weird about it because like some of those were harmless pranks, like the little erasing the nonfiction thing. That's cute. Everything else, I'm like, you're just ruining their jobs, bro. You're being massive inconveniences. And this is people's work. You know, you're no longer just affecting somebody like individually. You're fucking up their job. You know, that's a little too much. But like a little sign swappies and things like that. That's cute. That's not a big deal. But after that, ugh. You made reading far too fun. <laughs> so hey, we're coming back tonight. There's a certain book we forgot. No, they're gonna pin it all on you, Luz. Don't do it. They're gonna steal the book. Don't do it, Luz. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, well, at least it's true. It's been hours. How can it keep screaming? Uh, I hate it too, Pip. Rock, rock, maternal gesture. <laughs> That was the most revolting thing for her to do. I can't believe I have to do this. I can't believe I'm going to do this. <sighs> Caring, compassion, maternal gesture. Oh, it aches me so. <laughs> Aw, Nita, you look so motherly. Say that again, and I steal your tongue. Yep. It's like a Matryoshka doll! That breathes fire! Sure looks rewarding. Enjoy your life lessons. Bye! For the money! <laughs> Girl, what are you doing? This is fun to watch. You ready to bring this whole Damn, like those intolerant. Lose, lose, lose. Oh my god, the star's literally crying. Aww. Hmm, nothing happened. Wait. And when you close it, it stops? That's actually cool as hell. Oh, we dripped out. Oh, shit. Nothing happened. Oh. Wow. Honestly, this is just really cute. I don't see anything wrong with this. Yet, at least. I don't see anything wrong with it yet. <laughs> Obviously, it has to go wrong at some we point. The TV network for ages 6 to 11. That's insane. Oh, thank God. She is one crazy ass bitch. I thought she was going to be like, well, she only gave us one of them. We could probably get rid of the other two. And I. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> yeah. Being parental is making me sick. Oh, King is such a good boy. The many books he'd sown. Hey, don't deface the book. Hey, what the fuck? Now he's extra cute.
No. Don't fall for peer pressure. Whatever. We didn't come here just to doodle. Come oh my on. god. No, she left it open. You guys are into it. I think I'm into this one. Oh. Also, I love romance stuff. That's like one of my favorite genres. <laughs> secret hideaway mittens has gotten too full of herself <sighs> Luz I need you to make a good decision here Luz remember your initial goal befriending the older siblings so you can befriend Amity Luz make the right decisions be your own person come on Please. It's tough love. She needs to learn to lighten up. I'm gonna be real with you. That's what exactly what siblings do. They always go way the fuck too far. It's way too fucked up. And they go, it's fine. We're family. No, man. That shit's fucked up. Yeah. My sister and I went to the same high school together. I remember. Yep. <laughs> Not fun. Not fun. <sighs> oh, wow. I was really relieving. <laughs> I really got in my own head there. <laughs> uh, she told people I cut myself and everyone started to tell me to kill myself as a joke. <laughs> because she was student council president. So she was the cool kid. <laughs> And since I was her younger freshman sister, everyone was like, ha kill yourself. Emo, kill yourself. <laughs> and since she would say that to me, everyone else thought it was okay to say it to me. So. Yay. <laughs> and it all started because a guy that she liked, liked me instead. But I wasn't even into guys at the time. But I wasn't out yet, so. Yay. <laughs> We love high school. <laughs> like, what am I supposed to do? I'm not even into dudes at the time. I liked a girl. <laughs> Anyways. Wait, are those? <gasps> Cut with just Zara books one through four. Oh, that's so sick. She reads the same books as you. Her diary. I may have overreacted. I don't want to come off as cruel. I just can't show weakness. No, wait. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. But no one deserves this. Thank you. you. Man, if only actual teens had this mentality. Instead of being like, oh, wow, the, the cute, hot, popular girl said blah, blah, blah about her own sibling. Let's just believe it. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Man. Insane. The, what, the beauty of someone having their own individuality in their own mind. Holy fuck. teacher mom again uh, sorry i haven't written for a while wait why am i apologizing Not I wish I had to go. oh you're a bully loose 
Amity. Dad, that's crazy coming from her. Aren't you the one who literally posted racism on the timeline? Previous episode? <laughs> I don't know, Chief. I think... I think you're both a piece of shit <laughs> in this situation. Lou's definitely fucked up by being here and doing this shit. But also... <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, I, I don't know, girl. You are too. You guys are cool, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but I need to go talk to Mittens. I mean, I guess. Oh, oh, <laughs> it's kind of cute because she blushed at the guy and then she blushed at the girl after too. That's cute. Things somehow get worse. Oh, they're getting worse right now. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, that's a problem. Other little Amonies help, maybe? Oh! Oh, maybe she can make the like the cover art of Amity being like a powerful witch or something. Help her in the situation or something? I don't know, maybe? Maybe she can write something in the diary to help her? Maybe? Anything? Oh my god, he's turning her into pages. <laughs> are what I've always sought, and now a friend my claws have caught. Hey, she did it for herself! Let's go! Work of children's fiction. Let Girl, <laughs> you didn't write anything that the staff does. It's just a stick for now. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> oh. Making oh friends, well, taking friends never be without my friends. <laughs> no, we aren't. Follow my lead. One. What are you doing? Two. Oh, shit. I didn't even think that would work. I was all like. <laughs> yeah, that was adorable. Ah! Death is not adorable. Death is not adorable. Don't love that for you. God. Come on, Amity. You're supposed to be a talented witch, Amity! Oh, that's a problem! Okay! That's not magic, but it works! Fair enough, Amity! <laughs> it's funny because it's a 2D show. There is no tear. <laughs> I cannot mend. Yes! I'm so sorry. I don't know what came over. Oh, hey, it's okay. At least they're, at least they're okay. Wait, it doesn't make up for reading your diary, but 
Would you want to borrow this? <laughs> that is very true. Okay, you know what? She didn't really say sorry, but she also acknowledged that she's kind of a piece of shit towards her. I would take that as a W for a teenager or preteen to acknowledge those feelings. Good for you. All right. That's good stuff. Snuggly baby naps. Oh, Mama is I, and I is the bad queen. Okay. Oh, shit. What the f We got paid that much? Ah, sweet babe. Your night looks very successful. Look at all that money you made. Oh. Oh, they both missed the baby. Actually got you something from the library. Coping with empty nest syndrome is crazy. The babies left the house, and now the house feels empty without them. And now we need to cope. <laughs> no. That's not a thing anyone ever wants. Yep, Delic King. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll catch you later, YouTube. Thanks for your love and support always. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye! And much love to you too, Patreon. Bye!